Hi ladies, I'm just putting together my sellotape to make this work for you. Um, and I'm just about to do my Sunday morning ritual and I thought I'd do it with you um, because it's kind of one, I haven't shared much beauty recently and I've got a routine going and I'm quite liking my routine. And, um, and I just thought, ugh, quickly, very quickly, literally 10 minutes quickly. I'm first of all trying to get my hair further up my face. Okay, so I have discovered a new cleanser I'm absolutely loving and I'm just gonna tell you the names and show you slowly, good morning everybody, things I'm loving at the moment because I haven't been sharing. De Mamiel, there she is, De Mamiel. It's a really gunky cleansing balm and I use it on a Sunday morning. It's by Spider Space NK, it's quite expensive. The whole range is quite expensive. This is not unfortunately going to be things that are really cheap, all right, but I'm just gonna take you through. But what's good is it's very oily and it moves, so you can really massage your face. So in the morning, on a Sunday, usually, excuse me, let me readjust my towel, I get very puffy. Here, I just get puffy. I probably had far too much ice cream in bed. So I'm gonna do my little massage that's gonna de-puffy me. And I wanted to kind of be in my towel so that you could see exactly what I do. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, good morning, Russell. Good morning, Dominax. Good morning. So I take my two fingers and I go above my collarbone here and I just start pressing there to release my lymphatic. And I'm doing that sort of butterfly motion going down. Good morning. Good morning, Frederic. Good morning. Good morning. I, I'm very happy to see everyone live. I'll probably just be tense because I'm going to go and pick up Lila from school, but I thought I'd take you through it. Um, so I'm pressing there. This is all to release lymphatic. And when you do this one down here, be careful not to press too long a release. You know you're doing it in the right place. When you press, you feel a slightly tiny bit of lightheadedness. So obviously don't do this. Um, if you're low blood pressure, lightheadedness. Good morning, Amanda. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Ella. Good morning, Janice. I haven't got my glasses on. I'm, I'm squinting like this. So I do that for about 20, and that's going to kind of release the lymphatic up. And then I'll go under to my chin, and I go under here. Kind of, I'm, I'm, if you have long nails, this is tricky, but just pushing in, pushing in here. And there's another little emphatic bit there that's worth getting to. Again, I slightly feel if I do opposite sides, I'm getting in better. Under my chin here, pulse, pulsating. Slowly, pulse, 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 pulse like that. Then I'll come up to around my nose. And here especially, can I just say, with this routine I've been doing, I was having a lot of redness around my nose and it's gone. And I don't know what it's due to, but it's gone and I'm very happy. So it's a real mixture of quite healthy things with one or two chemical things. So I press there a bit like that. And then under my eyes, you see I'm very puffy here. I slept incredibly flat on my pillow and that really affects my puffiness. If I sleep slightly with my head up and a tiny bit with my feet up, my face is not puffy. But if I sleep like that, with my mouth drooling, so tired on a Saturday night, then I get this. So I then go in the corner here. Good morning, Jackie. Good morning, Lisa. How many of those are you doing watching this? White. Good morning, Lisa. White. What's she saying? White. I don't know what you mean, darling. White. Um, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So I'm just pressing in here, bit of releasing, and then going out trying to get that lymphatic working around my eyes. And then I'll do my classic. I'll just go up and down, up and down, up and down, keeping my eyes open. And this really helps with sort of, if you suffer from heavy eyelids when you wake up by pushing, sometimes it's good to do this, not with too much oil on your face, because you have to really keep the middle section of your brow pushed up. But that just helps to move around the system. I don't mind that I'm scrunching up my eyes because I don't do this all day long but it will help to lift my brow do you see it's already lifted a bit and then what I'll do I'm going to rush it up now I'll take a flannel in fact I want to take a hot flannel so hold on because it's cold one second just easy enough I can't do this wrong okay so then I take a hot flannel okay and I just rub that oil 
off my face. There we go. Okay, and then I'm just going to rub the remains with that. Oh. Okay, now put my glass on for a second, just say, good morning, good morning, good morning, Debbie, Celine, Kathleen, Natalie, Jackie, Moray, Susan, Lisa, Sai, Debbie, Gillian, Marina, Tanwan, Alison, Susan, Anna, Jelena, Julie, Agnesia, Agnesia, Mandy, Margarita, Derek, Lisa, Jackie, Lisa, Alexis, Debbie. Anyway, I'm trying to get you all in. Um, okay, let me just go back to where I was. So... What we're going to do this morning is I'm going to show you my little routine for cellulite, for baggy underarm, bat wings, and the rest of my face. I'm going to finish with my face. So I've run out of my copper isolate from Niod, which is such a brilliant product. I'm using a lot. It's a product you put on before anything else. It's blue. It smells of rusty pipes. But what it does is indirectly those peptides go in and they help to rebuild your collagen. So I'm going to go straight on to my next, which is CE Philuric by Skin Suticles. It's an essential vitamin C. It's one I rate a lot. And I always find that when I put it on my skin, I find that my skin just does really glow. And it's helping for the evenness of my skin tone. Now, I'm doing this with the towel this morning because I want to show you that every day how far down I take my skincare routine. It does mean I'm using nearly double, but I really go down to my neckline on a Sunday morning. Um, I try and do that during the week, you know, I'm sort of like that. But on Sunday morning, I really make an effort to get right down there. I have a very long neck. It's going to go at some stage, slightly going now, as somebody mentioned on Instagram, but it, um, it needs it. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Um, you want to, I know you're going to ask your questions and I'm sorry I've got my glass on. You need this advice this morning. If you just are happy to go with this ladies, because if I keep taking them on and off, I won't be able to show you the whole routine. Then, um, de Mamiel, I bought this in Space NK, do an antioxidant serum. Now you might think put a vitamin C on and then a serum. I can sometimes do five or six layers in the morning, but this antioxidant serum is just, comes in a little pipette. It's sort of milky, milky, sort of like sticky white stuff. Um, the smell is so good. It's healthy, herbally, and florally. So it's not too sweet, it's not too bitter herbally. The texture is divine. And as a serum to put on, so I'm putting it on under my eyes especially, I don't really hardly ever use an eye cream. It's just the most delicious serum. A really delicious serum. Just, oh, fantastic. So fantastic. Um, then I'm gonna ruin all that, but not ruin all that. And I'm going to put on a hyaluronic. Um, and this is again SkinCeuticals and it's HE Intensifier and it's quite a lot of hyaluronic in it. It's a kind of weird brownie color. Um, and many hyaluronics, there are some good ones and there are some dodgy ones. I think the ordinary do one, but it feels quite sticky when you put it on. So a lot of people think, if I'm giving my skin hydration, how, do I, how come I feel sticky afterwards? But that's what they do. It's a way that it can penetrate into your skin. It is a bit sticky, even this one's a bit sticky. But it's a way of giving hydration without sagging your skin, if that's the only way I can describe it to you. And I'm, I'm just liking this. I've used it now for 10 days and I think it's really great. I'm gonna finish up with some um, of my favorite treat, Sunday morning treat, which is um, Sisley's Black Rose um, face cream. And this is like their mask. I use the tiniest amount. I've had that now for about five months. And this is one I only use a few times a week. And I keep it as my treat. So that's my skin done. And then I'm just gonna very quickly do my face. And then I'm gonna show you two tricks I'm doing to help with my bingo wings, which I do have, and my um, getting um, my knees not saggy. So, cause I kind of think those are the things that are affecting me right now and I think they're affecting some of you. So I'm just gonna do, I've got all my stuff here. I'm just gonna do my BFF. I'm gonna do a bit of light and a little bit of medium. That BFF is my SPF 30 and it um, is light reflecting. So what it's gonna do now is I put an extra bit on a morning like this under my eyes, just to give that light reflective quality and to give that glow to my skin. So I'm just gonna 
put that on there. Let me just see. I know you're going, you're asking questions, my darling ladies. What eye cream would I suggest if you're rich enough to hydrate? I'm funny about eyes. I would say, you know, I talk about Opti Eye Crystal and I think it's quite a good one, but I, I like to use serums and I like to use normal products under my eyes. If your eyes are very dry underneath, it could be other things. Let me ponder on that. I haven't done my top secret seven eye creams for a reason, but I do believe in taking every serum and oil and taking it right up to your eye line. I just think that's the best way to do it. And I have started doing my eyelids a bit more because I think we neglect those. And then suddenly we wake up in our forties and we think our eyelids feel a bit dry. So that BFF, which comes in the tube like this for this, <laughs> um, is really giving my skin a freshness. And then I'm gonna have a real, real simple routine today. I'm just gonna look down and see what I need to put on my face. I'm gonna do a tiny bit under my eye, not much, but around my nose here where I've got a little bit of excess. I'm gonna use um, Trintron there, like that. And I wanna keep my cheeks fresh today because it's Sunday, I'll do a bit around my chin. Ah, uh, like that, there. And then I was thinking today, I'm gonna to use Tashi. Tashi is an old, lovely friend of mine. And if I've got it here, God, I hope I've got it here. Shit, of course I haven't got it here. No, I haven't got it here, so I can't use it. Oh, what a bore. What a bore. Bore, 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 bore. Okay, I'm going to use Wisdom on my eye. Very clean eye. Just a tiny bit today, like that. It's so quick to do an eye here at Trini London. There's my eye done. Two seconds flat makes my, eye blue, makes my eyes blue. It goes on my stack. Then I wanted to do Tashi. Then I can't believe I haven't got Tashi here. So... Let me see, let me see, let me see. Thea, Wiggs. Oh, I'm going to do some Wiggs. Wiggs is blusher, named after my sis. It's kind of pinky colour. So it's really exaggerating what I've got on my cheeks already. There, and then I'm going to do... Then I'm going to do... I want to do a neutral tone, and I so want to do... I so want to do that today. You know what I'm going to do in homage? Tomorrow, ladies, let me tell you what's happening. Susanna is coming in the house. I'm doing a Facebook Live with her at 5.30. This is her colour we got for her. Um, I'm going to put that on the bottom of my stack. And um, we're going to be going through getting her ready for her book launch. And for those of you who don't know Susanna, she's my erstwhile partner. And she, I called her up and I said, Susie, you need to look great for your book launch. You're looking a bit dodgy recently. Let's get you looking great. So Charlotte's going to do her makeup and I'm going to make sure she dressed fine. And I can't wait. And I hope you join us tomorrow at 5.30. There's my stack all done. Um, so I'm now going to do bat wings very quickly. I have this tool from Swiss Clinic. It's a micro needle. One. Quite strong. Not so many needles around the barrel. But I'm going to show you what I do. I'll take Dermastin, which is the... On one arm, I'm going to do this because you can't get this in England. On the other one, I'm going to do something else. So I take Dermastin, which is a vitamin A, quite strong body cream. And I will... Hang on, I'm going to put my glass on now for you asking things. Yes, we love Susanna. Fantastic. And I'm going to put a little bit there. This is a cream specifically targeting bat wing areas, okay? So I rub it in like that. And I just then start to massage. So when I massage, I'm really rubbing it hard. And I start to pinch, because I want to stimulate the blood. Pinch and rub. And I'll rub up and over, and then I'll pinch, 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 pinch. Get the blood flowing. Because you know what happens, ladies? Two things happens to create bat wing. One is we just get bigger because of menopause or whatever reason. And the other is our skin becomes more lax. Doesn't have the elasticity it used to have. So... You've got to stimulate it more. You've got to kind of wake it up, slap it around a bit. Really just get it going. Get the blood circulation. You see that blood circulation there? That's good. Seriously, that is good, okay? Then the blood circulation's going, and now what I'm gonna do, so weird this, I'm gonna take Votary, intense night oil, and I'm gonna put, oh no, hang on, I'm gonna do something else first, sorry. I'm gonna get my roller. I'm going to roll because I want to do a little bit of stimulation and I want to 
get a little bit of penetration for my next product and that's going to be the facial oil from Votary which has retinol in it and it's a night oil for the face but I use it here because I think a lot of us feel funny about our arms and oil goes a long way so I do have the extravagance of thinking I'll use it around this area. So I'm stimulating that further. I do crisscross motions like that, crisscross motions. And then inside of my arm, I don't, I feel the inside of my arm's fine, but it's just that back wingy bit here and it can, the skin can get a bit rough. I don't know if you find that. And then I'll take my votary there and I'll just put, I'll just put that much on like that. And then I'll rub it in. Rub, 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 rub and massage. Rub and massage. Excuse me, I'm gonna fall out my towel. Okay, rub and massage like that. You can see it's stimulated. Pinch again, pinch again, pinch again. I just do this probably twice a week, but it is my Sunday morning ritual. And also, what's so good about this? Let's just be honest. I like the idea, and there's definitely a word for this. Sorry, my towel's coming apart. <laughs> I love the idea that when we try and massage with one part of our body, the other part is really working. It's a workout for it. It tones it because there's so much energy going into working out that arm that we're actually, it's like we're lifting a weight with this arm. Sorry, I've got a real, hang on. I've got a real wardrobe malfunction. There we go. So, uh, Rubbing right. And if I feel now, can I tell you, if I feel that arm now, it feels incredibly soft. And if I feel this arm, there's a dryness just here, which is where we never get to in our arms. So I'm going to go again and I'm going to get the Dermastine from South Africa. If you can find it, it took me forever. It took me six months to find this product, but it's utterly brilliant for our uh, bingo wings. So brilliant. So I'm going to go again. I'm working out the other arm by how much I'm rubbing this up and down. I'm pinching. Pitching away, I'm feeling exhausted doing this, but it's, that's the kind of treatment it is. Um, okay, really, pinch. Don't feel scared of pinching your body. Stimulate those tired old collagen bits. Oopsie, hold on. I should have had some other method. Um, really, rub, rub up and down and pinch. Rub up and down and pinch. And then, Excuse me. Then get your roller and roll. Roll in a slight crisscross. This is a Swiss clinic one. And um, lots of people do a dermal, uh, um, microneedling roll for the body. This is a 1.0. You can use much bigger needles on your um, body than you can on your, fuck. Than you can on your face. Do not use this on your face unless you're with a practitioner doing it for you because one is quite high. Remember to go there where it's wobbling and um, just see that stimulation. I, I've, I feel very comfortable when I see that my skin is stimulated because I feel the blood is rushing to the surface and um, it's kind of good. So do that crisscrossing I'm showing you very quickly now. Then I take my lovely Votary Retinol Night product oil because it's just a very, very good oil. And it has some, I think, natural samphire in it, which is giving the retinol. There we go. And I rub it in, rub it in. So now, because I've done the microneedling, it will penetrate much further. I could also bring this round to my neck. Um, I'm doing the night one only on my um, body because a retinol you don't want to use in the day. And then I could do double. And then what I do, I'm going to show you what I end with. So I've got to go down and read the papers now. Is I've just got myself for that lymphatic drainage. Hang on a ticky. I've got myself a mini trampoline. So, every morning, I'm gonna try and do this because it does release the lymphatic and it makes your system work again. And I think that's what I need and my knee's been playing up. So I kind of think this is really going to get my body waking up. I might do a bit on one leg, I might, jog on it like this do a little bit of jogging i'm already exhausted you can tell how much exercise i've been doing the last few months but i thought whilst it's cold and i don't know how often i'll be going to the park i'm listening to danielle shine by the way i have not had wheat all week 
since we saw Danielle two weeks ago. Chloe has been magnificent and I um, have been pretty good about the other things too. Not snacking on unhealthy things. I got the healthy peanut butters. I substituted most of my unhealthy snacks for healthy snacks. So ladies, go and see Danielle Shine's video. Let's try and feel fit and fabulous for Christmas. Fit and fabulous for Christmas. Oh yes. On five and four and three and two and one. And I'm so done. I'm so done. Oh my God, I'm so done. I'm exhausted, exhausted. There we go. I'm off to see Lila. Makeup's looking fresh. My, where am I now? Where am I now? Makeup's looking fresh. There's my stack. There's my stack. And have a really lovely Sunday. I'll see you tomorrow, six-ish. Did I say six? I'd say 5.30, sorry, 5.30, with Susanna and Charlotte. We'll be doing a makeover on her. Have a wonderful day, bye.